We come together today as people of faith, working together to create a culture of peace. Peace in our world. And we are led by those who have come before us. Abraham, Muhammad, and Jesus. We have many speakers today, and I would like to uh, have some of the speakers who are ready to speak here today. So why don't we hear from Rabbi Jerome Davison, the rabbi from Beth Israel in Great Neck. I am very proud to be here as a Jew on this day in which we commemorate George Washington, the first president of the United States. When he was elected, a small synagogue in Newport, Rhode Island, sent him a letter of congratulations. And he wrote back a promise. He said that America shall be a country in which every man shall be able to sit in safety and there will be none to make him afraid. But he went on to say that America shall be a country that will give to bigotry no sanction and to persecution no assistance. I think that all of us understand the importance of protecting the security of our people and the importance of investigating terrorism. But if it is done in such a way as to persecute one valued group of citizens in our country, then it is wrong. For the American Muslim community has taken up arms against our enemies. They died at 9-11, and they are valued citizens of our towns and our cities. They are as dedicated to America as any other faith group, you may be sure of that.